to Sydney, to Melbourne, and then come back. Knowing that we'd won it, you know, it's a pretty special time and um, you know, to obviously do it with all the other boys as well, which the majority of us we'd done the year before was just something that would, I'm sure I speak on behalf of everybody, so it's something we'll, uh, we'll take to the grave with us. The road to Premiership glory began five weeks earlier when we defeated West Coast in Perth to secure a qualifying final against the Dees in Melbourne. The less said about that game, the better. And they'll be singing long and hard in the club rooms tonight. We got flogged and we went out of that game probably with our tail between our legs. They're going to have to regroup and uh, probably have a good look at uh, how they did play uh, uh, today and uh, really get fired up for uh, next week. I think we went down by almost 10 goals in the end and uh, the way the final system was but then we were lucky that we still got a second chance and was able to continue our journey. And that took us to a rain drenched Sydney. And we ended up actually having a really good win so it was a fabulous response from you know the poor effort that we played the week before to virtually really dominate Sydney um, and win quite comfortably, um, which put us obviously into the prelim final. It is all over for Sydney. Adelaide will march on. Fortunately, we were well managed through the finals campaign. With Malcolm Blight, it was actually quite good. The way he approached it was pretty relaxed. And I think having that kind of relaxed approach to us travel and the way we did things helped us through uh, a pretty gruelling travel schedule. And there was never the talk of winning it for the second time. It was basically, okay, this is our next opposition, this is the, game, the team we're playing, let's beat these guys, then we move on to the next weeks. And just like 97, that meant a preliminary final at the G against the Bulldogs. Probably my favourite game, yes. I uh, was lucky enough to kick a couple of snaggers, and, um, yeah, but I think full credit goes to the blokes who are up the field. I got some some wonderful service from the likes of Mark Bickley and, uh, and Tyson Edwards with a couple of their terrific passes. Thanks for the mention, Matty. Your six goals certainly helped, as did a lazy seven from Bungie. It gets from about 55 from <laughs> <laughs> A five-day turnaround and we were back in Melbourne, daring to dream. Who are you going for, Graham? Oh. Here's your tip. Oh, not too good. I've tipped the draw. I'm staying with it. We overpowered the kangaroos in the last half and we were really able to savour that premiership feeling. You get to that point where you're trying to keep professional but you're smiling so at the other players because you kind of know that you're probably going to win and I can't remember exactly when that happened but I know it was happening because I was doing it. You know, I'm sure the club's proud of what we did. Everyone associated with the team was absolutely proud of what we were able to achieve um, that year but also the year before as well.